In this video, I will show you how you can create an animation video right inside Photoshop. Apart from being a photo editing software, Photoshop has the provision to create simple animations with it as well. So without losing any more time let's quickly start the video. Let's open a background image layer over which we are going to create a text animation. Below the image, you can see a timeline area that you can toggle on and off by clicking on the Windows tab and then on the Timeline option. Click on the Create Video Timeline button to create this video editing interface. As you can see there are two tracks. One for video and one for audio. The first video track is taken up by our background image layer. Now I am going to type some text over it. Notice a new track for the text layer has been created on the timeline. Convert both the layers into a smart object. Drag the blue playhead right in the middle of the timeline. Then click on this drop down arrow of the text layer track. It will open up the options to set keyframes. Being the playhead paced in the middle of the timeline and the text aligned at the center of the frame, click on this clock icon to set the keyframe. Then move the blue playhead to the beginning of the timeline. Now selecting only the video track of the text layer, drag the text right outside the frame. As soon as you let go of your mouse button, it will automatically create a keyframe at the beginning of the timeline. Now if we play the preview you already got your animation. But we want the text to enter the frame from the right, stay at the center of the frame for some time and then leave out of the frame from the left side. For that, you have to again drag the blue playhead at the end of the timeline and simultaneously drag the text out of the frame. Then drag this keyframe a bit towards the left. Place the playhead again in the middle of the track and drag back the text to the center of the frame. Now play the preview of the animation. Now we will try another type of animation by modifying the opacity of the text layer. I am going to delete the layer and type it again to do away with all the previous animations. Open the keyframe options of it. Convert it into a smart object. Placing the playhead at the beginning of the timeline, click on keyframe settings. Drag forward the playhead and change the opacity value of the text layer to zero. Do this several times along the track. Now if you play the preview, it gives you animation something like this. To export this animation, click on this icon to find lots of options for different video resolutions as per your need. Name your output file from here. Click on the select folder to set the output folder. After everything is set, click on Render. Hope you liked this tutorial. For more Photoshop tutorials, subscribe to the channel. If you want to watch a detailed camera raw tutorial, then you can click on this link and I will see you in my next video.